And I'm assuming he's going to be back in two weeks. I Until that doesn't happen, I'm going to assume that. But again, it's not like this came out of left field. At least I don't think so. You didn't know he was going to want more money. Did he just, were, were, were you just right. hanging out the one day and then he just didn't show up the next day? You didn't. Did you, you guys see for, this coming? You, you guys forgot that the rest of his contract wasn't guaranteed. Like, did you forget right. that? Like, <laughs> like what? did you not see this coming? Are you not having no. organizational discussions where you say, all right, well, Trent's like the sixth highest paid tackle right now. Do mm. we want to go to him and say, listen, man, we love you. I, my question is, does that really matter to Trent anymore? Or is it more about I'm 36. I want guaranteed money because at any point my career could be over in one right. play. I think it's yeah. that. I don't. I don't. I don't know that they have to make him the highest paid tackle, but I think what they have to do is guarantee more of his money. And for whatever reason, they haven't done that yet. And to me, that again doesn't make uh, doesn't make any sense. <laughs> again, you're you're assuming he's going to be there next year. I don't think they went into the season thinking this is the last year of Trent. I think they were hoping we have another couple of years with him. Mm -hmm. Just guarantee these two years. Give him a pay bump this year and guarantee next year. I don't understand what the holdup is there. Yeah, and I don't understand why again this was was this. A surprise mm -hmm. how did you not see this coming how did you not address this let's let's go to him and make sure this this doesn't happen